How's it going everyone? It's been a while since my last uh, video, but I wanted to do a simple one today just to kind of show what I found last night. I'm kind of hadn't heard about this, but it's been around for a while. Uh, the add-on it's called TV Tunes. It's uh, I just thought it was kind of neat because it will add a little bit of flair and and uh, uniqueness to your Kodi setup. What it does is you can download the theme songs for the TV shows you have. Uh, one thing to keep in mind, though, you'll need you'll need a personal library or you'll need uh, to have your content in your library. So in the TV shows, so if you're just using uh, things like Genesis or One Channel or whatever, uh, this won't work unless you add that content into the library. I've got another tutorial on my channel to to add content in, from Genesis into your library, so check it out. Uh, but let's get started. Uh, it's pretty simple. You don't really need to do anything. You just need to install the add-on. And the nice thing is it's on the Kodi repository. So to do that, we just go to Programs. And we want to get more. And so from here, I'll maybe back up a little just to make it a little easier to understand. So when you hit, uh, you go to install an add-on, you should be greeted with this screen right here. So we want to install from repository and you should see the Kodi add-on repository. And then we want to choose program add-ons. And from here, we just gotta scroll down to TV tunes. Hit install. And just give it a sec as it does its job here. Let's see a couple notifications in the bottom right that it's being added. So now it's enabled. Now we can go back to the main screen. That's basically it's basically all you have to do to get the program running. Uh, installed, sorry. Now we need to associate it with the TV shows we have. Um, so I've uh, I've added some content from Genesis into my TV show library just for this demonstration to show that it does work. Um, but you can use if you've got a, a NAS server and stuff like that, you can use that. Uh, so let's just go through this. So these are the TV shows I've saved. So to start doing this, uh, you just got to highlight one of the shows and bring up the context menu by pressing C on the keyboard or if you've got a something else, I'll kind of leave it in your hands to do that. So you should see an option that says TV Tunes. So we just click TV Tunes and it should do a search. Um, now some content is, isn't on uh, the initial search website so you can just hit search using. Now televisiontunes.com is the one I, I believe it initially searches so it didn't find anything on there. So you can use SoundCloud, GoGear or you can search using all the sites. Uh, I typically just use SoundCloud because it's, it's usually got uh, the results I'm looking for or some kind of wacky remix. All right, so now we've got a whole bunch of options here. So I'm just going to choose this one because it looks kind of the most legit. I'm not going to, I'm going to try not to play it too long so I don't get into any issues with uh, YouTube. So we'll just hit it and it should do a preview. As you can, so you can, so if you've, if that's the one you want, you just click yes, and if you want to go back and try something else, then you hit no. Um, so let's just maybe try one of my new favorite shows, Mr. Robot here. So they don't really, I don't even know if it has the theme now that I think about it. <laughs> But you'll see that sometimes it'll come up here with something completely that different that doesn't match. So you just hit search using. We'll try True Detective. Oops. Let's see what comes up with this. Okay, so now you see True Detective 24. That's the latest, latest one. So I'll try this again. And it'll give me a preview. So that's what we want. So now we'll download, hopefully. Um, one thing to keep in mind with this is 
I've got most of my content on a separate server. Um, it will download the songs. Uh, if you're streaming it from your server, it will download the songs and save it on your server, which is good uh, in terms of storage. If you're using something like an Android box, like a Fire TV, uh, and you're just you're using Genesis to add content to your library to accomplish this, one thing to keep in mind is just the storage, because over time, it will add up, and there's there's really a lot of limited storage on some of those smaller devices. So I'm just gonna show you really quickly True Detective, so we're going to start scrolling and the song should come on. And that's it. That's all you have to do. I hope you enjoyed it.